Well, well, June 21st, 2022, and we are still sitting in the Coquihalla City Campground. I mean, I guess things being what they are or being equal um, could be worse. Um, we've been here, I think this is day eight, still waiting on our replacement swing arm. And uh, based on tracking info, it's not due to get here until uh, June 29th. Um, so I think by if it comes on June 29th, we'll have been here two weeks. It doesn't look like we're going to make it to Tuk Tuk Tuk. Um, I think what we're going to do is... Just go up into Alaska after we get all this, these repairs taken, taken care of. Um, and we'll see. I, I mean, I'm taking, we're taking this time to get some projects done. I just got done uh, greasing all the heim joints and all my uh, control arms. And uh, I'm going to do some uh, lubing of some... Uh, Zerk fittings and just take care of some stuff that I needed to do in Washington that I didn't get a chance to do. Um, probably going to uh, replace the other five uh, coil packs just so I have a, you know, all the coil packs are brand new and fresh. And we're just going to make the most of uh, our time here in uh, British Columbia or this part of British Columbia. And hopefully, I'm dirty, sorry, was under the truck. Um, and hopefully, you know, we're trying to uh, keep up good spirits. I've had my ups and downs. You know, I was hope, you know, expecting these this part to be here. Let me back up. Was hoping that this part would be here soon enough for us just to make it to Tuk Toyuk Tuk. Um, but as it looks... Apparently, two weeks is expedited to some people. Um, I would say no. But we're going to make the most of this, and we're going to have fun. Um, we're still camping out of the trailer, um, which is good. I mean, we're not spending huge money on a hotel, so that's good. Um, you got. I, I'm just doing my best to look at this. You know, again, like I said in the last video... Adversity enhances the adventure, people say. Well, I'm hoping our adversary, adversity is done for the trip. Um, we've, we've been pretty lucky in the last 40,000 miles. You know, this is the worst thing that's happened. And uh, I think, you know, as much as we don't like it, it does make you a better long-term traveler, overlander, what do you wanna, whatever you want to call yourself. But what I would tell you is be prepared. I mean, I thought I had all the bases covered, but I would have never thought that, a, you know, we'd have a, a breakdown like this. So all you can do is prepare to the best. Make sure you have the tools you need. Make sure you have the spare parts you need, you know, especially on these longer term uh, trips. Well, that's about it for now. And once we have a, uh, more information, you know, last we checked in our uh, tracking, it was, I think, flying across, across the United States. So at least it's in Northern, uh, North America. Um, and we're trying to get the delivery expedited so we don't have to wait until the 29th to get our part. So we'll keep you updated. And I hope everybody's having a good time and enjoying life because you only get one.
Oh, this is what we've been wanting to see. Our part Hi. is here. can get on the road within the next day or so. Thank you, Patriot Campers. Yay! Yay! Awesome. Oh, man. And don't even need a signature. That's it. That's all. Excellent. We didn't think it was going to come. At least not today. Yeah. FedEx has your back. Dude, <laughs> yeah, you guys FedEx, were awesome. FedEx has had our back. It's, uh, they were saying the well, we thought it was going to be here on the 29th. And oh, that, up until the middle of this morning, that's what it said. And all of a sudden, FedEx surprised us. And it got here today. And today is the 22nd. 22nd of June. And it wasn't due here until the 29th of June. We were stressing. So we got to see what they sent us. Hopefully, it's got bushings and everything. Otherwise, we're going to have to reuse the original bushings, even though they should be okay. They packed it fairly well. Yeah. It's on carpet. It's on carpet. <laughs> Anybody need a carpet sample? Well, we got more firewood. I'm using my retirement knife to cut this. Sorry about the lighting, everyone. The sun came out and it's starting to get warm. Look so this is a swing, a... Cruise Master XT Cruise XT Cruise swing arm. And those are big zip those ties. Those are some hardcore zip ties. And I'm thinking that's the bushings and I am thinking you are correct. This is what we've been waiting for. This is what we've been uh, Let me get around here. worrying after. Thank you, Patriot Campers, for coming through in the middle Thank of a Thank you, lurch. Exploration Outfitters. It took a little while, but it is here. And we're happy. We just got to check the studs and make sure they sent 6 by 139 Yeah, that would be a bummer. But yeah, this is what we've been waiting for. And as you see, the hub or the uh, spindle is integral to the swing arm, so you can't just replace the stub axle. Our part came! So, this is yeah. one of the wonderful gentlemen here at this park. They have worked with us. They have been awesome. Alright, let's start digging into this. <laughs> 